Zetakwe Ajakuta Wari Ray Station, which started in the year 1983, is opening for commercial activities after more than three decades delay. At the visual opening of the rail line linking Itakwe to Wari, President Muhammad Wari directed the Federal Ministry of Transportation to link all the nation's ports of origin and destination, Apapa, Tinka, Wari, One, Calabar ports, to the rail network in order to significantly improve overall transportation and economic capacity. Cities. He directed that to further give recognition to Nigerian sons and daughters who have distinguished themselves at nation building and development, 11 rail stations be named after some deserving citizens. He listed them to include Adamu Ita Station, Itakwe Abubaka Olushola Saraki Station, Ajaukuta Augustus Aikomo Station, Itogbo George Ini Station, Agenebode Antoni Inauru Station, Uromi Tommy Kimi Station, Ikehe and Samo Ugumuja Station, Igbanke. Others are Good Luck Jonathan Railway Complex, Agbo Owa Oibo, David Ejo Station, Abraka Mike Ibru Station, Opara Alfred Rewane Station, Ujewo and Mike Akigbe Railway Village Agbo. I want to use this opportunity to assure Nigerians that government will continue within the limit of our resources to judiciously marshal and industry towards the realization of consistent and sustainable economic growth. Minister of Transportation Rotimi Amechi said the project was fully funded by the Nigerian government, adding that 8 out of 10 stations are in the Niger Delta region of the country. In his remarks, Delta State Governor Ifan Okowa commended President Buhari's bipartisan approach to governance, noting that it is a thing of pride and joy that the rail line was completed under his watch. This rail line has strong potentials for stimulating social economic activities and bringing support to low-income earners. In the post-COVID-19 era, where governments all over the world are looking for ways and means to rebound their economies, this project has the capacity to kickstart new small-scale businesses, support existing ones, and rejuvenate the rural economy. In his goodwill message, Edo State Governor Gordon Obaseki, while congratulating President Buhari on the feat of completing the project, appealed to the Minister of Transportation to extend the rail line to the industrial park in Benin City to facilitate the movement of goods to the northern part of the country. It is quite for Twitters that a few days to our 60th anniversary, independence anniversary of the country, our president has achieved this feat in completing a critical infrastructure required for our development in this country and in our region. According to President Buhari, the commencement of operation of the Taipei Ajaukuta rail line would account for close to 1 million passengers annually. Patience, Osaugiwa reporting.